Hi, and welcome to TC. So I think it's pretty normal when one person moves from their home country to a new country to look at all the new things they encounter in their new country and wonder how come they don't do things the way they do it back at home. This is true even for me, and even though Canada may be the most similar country to the United States as any other country. But there are occasionally things that come up and I'm like, why do they do it this way? Why can't they just do it like they do it back home in America? That being said, there are occasionally things that I run across here in Canada and I'm like, wow, that's brilliant. How come they don't do it like this back in the States? Here's a short video to illustrate one of those things. Now, this seems peculiar to one particular store in Canada, but to be fair, this is a pretty big store. It's called the Canadian Superstore, or the Great Canadian Superstore, or something like that. It's something like a Super Walmart, but with more produce and more food and a little bit less of the non-perishables. One of the first things that happened to me when I came to Superstore was I had to get a shopping cart and I had no idea how to do it. In fact, my wife had to show me how to do it. It does require the use of a loony or a Canadian $1 coin. And it goes something like this. All the carts are always perfectly aligned at one of the shopping cart stalls. It's very easy to get. You just insert this little loony into the slot here and then the chain in the back pops out. And when it pops out, you can freely pull the shopping cart out of the stall. When you want to bring the shopping cart back into the stall, you just push it back in like normal. But in order to get the loony that you put in there back out, you have to reinstall this little chain, stick it back in there, and the loony comes back out. So basically, you're putting in a $1 deposit for use of the shopping cart, which you can get back immediately once you put the shopping cart back into some other shopping cart. This naturally means that everybody wants to put the shopping carts back into the stalls. And all the shopping carts are therefore very orderly. You don't have random shopping carts lying around in the parking lot or bumping into other cars or to other people or to other shopping carts. To be fair, the Canadian Superstore is the only store that seems to do this. I've gone to Walmart, I've been to London Drugs, and in fact, here's a little clip from when I went to London Drugs. They also have similar type shopping carts that use a quarter, but uh, the little mechanisms don't seem to work anymore. You can't insert the quarter anywhere, and all the chains and little keys are locked into themselves. So functionally, this thing doesn't work anything like the Superstore carts, and it's just a regular cart. But I thought to myself, this is a brilliant idea. This just encourages people to put shopping carts back in order, creates less work for all the staff of the grocery store, and makes it less dangerous because there's not random shopping carts lying around in the parking lot. I'm not entirely sure why all the stores here don't do this, or how come there aren't stores in America that do this, but this is one of those things where I'm like, yeah, that's a good idea. Go Canada. This has been another report with the teal colored eyeglasses. Glasses off.